how to edit your YouTube thumbnail on Facebook. Hi, I'm Del Edwards and today I just want to share um, a quick little tool with you uh, to help you edit your YouTube thumbnail when you upload YouTube videos to Facebook. So I'm going to show you a little example. I had a YouTube video that I have on Facebook and I'm going to put it here. And I uploaded the YouTube video here and no thumbnail showed up. There's nothing here. And the reason that no thumbnail showed up is because right now on YouTube I have this video um, listed. It's, it's listed as private. And so when it's private, nothing shows. But so now I'm going to take that video on YouTube and I'm going to change the setting. I'm going to make it public just for this video. And I'm going to publish it. Now when I go back to Facebook, I can refresh my page and I can try again. And oops, it still doesn't show the thumbnail even though I published it. And the reason that it doesn't show the thumbnail is because Facebook keeps a memory of your, your um, video information the first time you um, include it or post it. Um, so if you post that to Facebook or uh, try to upload it to Facebook or just put the link in here and you have no thumbnail, even if you change that, Facebook is going to keep a record of that. So the only way to change that is to use what's called a Facebook debugging tool. You want to go to um, Google and just go and just type in debugger or object debugger or Facebook debugger and you're going to land up on a page like this. It's called a Facebook developers tool and it's officially called the Open Graph Object Debugger. And what you're going to do is paste the URL for the YouTube for the YouTube video in the box, the input URL, and you can see what the existing scrape information is or what the existing information is that Facebook has saved for this um, YouTube video and you can see it says when shared this is what will be included and that's exactly what we saw on our video um, here. And so now we're going to click fetch new scrape information And now the new scrape information should include the thumbnail that we originally had. So now when you go back to Facebook and put your link in, your URL for your video, you'll see the thumbnail pop up. Now it shows. I hope you found this to be helpful. Go ahead and like this video, subscribe to my channel, and share it with someone. Until next time.